<laughs> oh, man, dog. I already knew they erased our African history and our names and our language, and I'm very well aware of that. Yes, but I didn't know it was immediate history, like right after slavery, that we're not very well informed on, and especially in our own city. Like, you know what I'm saying? Why in America are we still whitewashing history? In 2019, these things still aren't aren't talked about. Like, that's ridiculous. With our stories now, with social media and the internet, things won't get lost in translation. History can actually be preserved, and African-American history can actually be documented. Brown people often too much look at where white people at and think we have to be there, and we, if we're not exactly we're doing what white people are doing, or wealthy white people, or rich white people are living by their standing, we're not doing right. Because even what bothers me as a hip hop head, it hurts to listen to everybody go sort of na 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 na. Like, my Rolex is brighter than yours. Like, we all came from the same neighborhood that's kind of poor, so we should be trying to build each other up. I would, I would like to see a day where success doesn't have to mean getting out of the place that I was born and raised in.